In today's mobile minute, we'll be showing you how to come in, purchase a piece of glass, and properly get it home. Most of the time, you'll come in, give us the size, we'll cut the glass, and we'll wrap it in paper, and you'll be easily to take it home. But sometimes you have a bigger window, and it requires a bigger piece of glass, such as this, and you'll need to get this properly home. First of all, I would get maybe some safety gloves. Uh, you can purchase these kind of rubbery gloves. You see, I think most of you have seen these now. And uh, most home depots and gloves and whatnot carry these, and they're not very much. But the rubbery grip that it gives will really hold the glass good and keep you from getting cut. One thing you want to do with glass is don't pick it up like this. Because, as you can see, it's bouncing. And it's liable to snap in the middle because of the size it is. And you'll end up cutting yourself or someone next to you or whatever. But proper use is to bring it, just bring it to the side and just now naturally draw. And then you can pick it up and then you can hold it. And you can hold it with your gloves and you can hold it all day. And if you need to rest, you can just rest it on your shoes, hold it like this. Now, what you're gonna want to do is let's go outside and we'll show you how to put it in your car. A common mistake I see a lot of people do is when they pick up a piece of glass, they'll want to just set it on the ground. And uh, when, you, when you do that, you're going to chip the corners. And uh, you never want to just set it on the ground. If you need to, you can have yourself a couple of sticks. You can get them at home or wherever. But never set it on the ground. What you're going to want to do is always set it on something so that you're not doing that kind of thing. And th that'll happen really easily. Now that we're here at the car, we want to make sure that the car is ready for the glass. And as you can see, it's pretty much ready there, but there's a couple things on the floor I want to move. And now I can put the glass in there safely. And as you can see, that went in fairly safely. And it will ride pretty good this way. Uh, making sure that you don't drive fast and just watch your bumps. Basically, just some good driving habits there. And, and now we want to get the glass out of the vehicle and to put it somewhere safe. If you need help, Get a help from someone else to help you carry the glass. But always, like I said, put it on some wood, something like this, so that it's not touching the pavement. And uh, after that, it's uh, get the window fixed.